Hey, this is Chris Rourke. I'm the managing editor at Star Local Media Newspapers, and here's what you can expect to see in Sunday's issue of the Colony Courier Leader. We'll have a story that provides an update on the Main Street uh, project. Uh, the bulk of the project is already complete, but there's still a few minor things left to be done, uh, so we'll take a look at what remains on that project. Also, Louisville ISD recently hosted its Back to School Fair, so we'll have a story about what all went on at that event. And finally, we'll have a feature about a local man who has spent the last 10 years adopting uh, foreign exchange students. So be sure to check out this Sunday's issue of the Colony Courier Leader. Join us as we kick off the 2017 football season with a preview of our local high school football team. Star Local Media's 2017 Gridiron Preview will be full of team photos and rosters, district previews, schedules, upcoming rivalries, and key players to watch. Check it out on newsstands beginning August 24th or follow along all season at gridirononline.com. How's it going? I'm Justin Thomas, sports writer here at Star Local Media. Just giving you a little rundown of what you can find in this weekend's publications. We are continuing, or I should say finishing, our final week of our question series. That's where we look back at the different districts, 5-6-A, 9-6-A, and 14-5-A. We take a look back at last year also, as well as what might be coming up this year. So this will be the final installment of that series. We also have a question and answer story with Louisville ISD Athletic Director Tim Ford, as well as some uh, recaps of the first week of action of high school volleyball that got underway this week. So all those stories can be found in this weekend's publications or on starlocalmedia.com. Thanks.